All right, it's time to come home. Two Houston-based astronauts on board the SpaceX Crew Dragon capsule. They'll leave the International Space Station on Saturday this week. Here's a closer look at Bob Benkin and Doug Hurley's return trip. In some ways, returning to Earth from the International Space Station will be very similar to how Crew Dragon arrived there, very methodically. The first step is to undock from the ISS. After the capsule has been packed up and prepped for undocking, Dragon will back away and slowly make its way outside of the keep out sphere. That's a safety zone around the orbiting laboratory. The onboard Draco engines will then be used for a series of phasing burns to move Dragon into a lower orbit and orient itself for re-entry. As it gets closer to Earth, Dragon will ditch its trunk or service module right before its final deorbit burn. And that's when things get interesting fast. Crew Dragon will enter the atmosphere around 17,000 miles per hour. Now the particles in the atmosphere will cause Dragon to slow down, but will also heat the outside of the spacecraft to more than 5,000 degrees Fahrenheit. That's hot enough to vaporize steel. This is where the Dragon's heat shield plays a critical role in protecting Dragon and the crew members inside. After this fiery stage of re-entry, four parachutes will deploy doing the final part to slow down Crew Dragon ahead of a gentle splashdown somewhere off the coast of Florida.